All right, so we are back once again in the dungeon quarantine central with another box bag something all the way from China. So why don't we open it up and let's see what's inside. This thing is even that's like taped up all funny in that so I guess we can just cut into it with our rusty knife and what do we have today inside we have bubble wrap Apparently, I'm going to have to cut open. And so we have the Game Player X12 Plus HD Ready. USB, seven inch screen. Take a look at the box here. Got all the pictures. I sprocket, music notes, video, joystick, microphone, photographs. World of Entertainment, memory card 16G, color selection. Play more games. Yeah, these probably don't play on the system. Let's see the back here. Technical specifications. Seven inch true color, high definition TFT screen. 6M to infinity photo format, JPEG video formats, 3GP, MP4, AVI, RMVB, RM. Resolution 800 by 400 at 30 FPS at 3 megabytes per second. Audio format, MP3, WMA, WAV, IAMRAPE, FL, Space AC for some reason, instead of just FLAC, I don't know, AEC. Game formats, NES, 32-bit games, support NES format, game download, six, I don't know, customization, I don't know. There's all this words here. Some of it might actually make sense, but you can, you can read that. One piece of gift box. And there's a, another picture of a game you won't be able to play on it. And all the little appropriate, but probably lying symbols at the bottom there. So why don't we flip it open? Oh, I forgot to mention SRS, real, H.264, HD ready, USB. All right, well, here is, we'll put this to the side for a moment just so we can admire the amazingness of this box. The highest quality Chinese plastic. And underneath here, more bubble wrap. And we've got some headphones. We've got a USB to USB 
Is that USB mini? I guess that's USB mini. And uh, AV cable, even though this is supposedly HDMI ready. And we have our instruction book, which we will promptly ignore because it won't tell us anything anyway. So let's go back here. Take a look at this fine piece of technology. I will admit it is a lot larger than I thought it was going to be. So there's your USB mini. Looks like SD card slot with no SD card in it. Looks like power button, plus and minus. A switch here, which I guess just turned the unit on. Okay, that's fascinating. I don't know. Why is there a button labeled power and a switch that actually turns the power on and the button just makes a beep noise? Oh well. That's not even remotely annoying. Oh, let's see here. Oh, there's some games. Fatal Fury. I guess that's Super Nintendo there. Game Boy Advance, 3D arcade game. Captain Com. Oh, Super Mario. Don't, it doesn't appear to actually be doing anything. Oh, there we go. For some reason you hit B. And it's Super Mario Brothers. Whoa. Uh. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm a little speechless right now. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Um, this, I know this is not a touch screen. Um, so, but of course for the price point, I wouldn't expect it to be. The picture is not the greatest. It's not terrible, but it's not. I don't. 